what we should know as a country is that politics has eaten into every sector of our economy, from the judicial systems to everything. What I would advise the judiciary, can we run away from politics? Can we kindly uh, uh, stand up for the integrity of judiciary? Let us remember that the judiciary is not an elective agency. And that's why today we are here, to be able to give solutions and the way forward for our country. Because Kenyans are watching, Kenyans are listening to what is happening. Do we continue complaining and keeping quiet? No. Something must be done. Therefore, one of the key uh, economic drivers that must be given um, the necessary budgets and focus is we have just discussed energy because everything goes around energy even the media here all this is energy so when electricity is high everything will collapse <laughs> If you have to talk about the petroleum products, we have nine. Can we reduce them to four? So that the government is right now getting 79.3%. Can we reduce what the government is getting from these levies to at least about 55? So that Wajiko can breathe life a bit. We have talked about five key interventions that must be undertaken. We must also open up the, 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 the energy purchasing power because when we are not... Um, in competitive bidding and we embrace g2g arrangement we expose ourselves to maybe high cost of energy while we we open up to competitive bidding we can get it at affordable at affordable markets <laughs>